So yeah, it was uh, Grayson and Yellow Rello. So that is the person that I used to play on uh, game battles all the time. All right, you know what? <laughs> Times don't change, man. I was, <laughs> I was like, I know I recognize that name somewhere, man. <laughs> and now, nah, man, we we used to be out here, bro. Okay. Game battles, game battles, and brawl days. And he still played Yoshi. Wait, so he's been a Yoshi main since brawl. For a, I mean, honestly, he might have been a Yoshi main in melee. Who knows? I just I, I met him in brawl, so <laughs> good times. That's crazy. Right. Man, I can't believe it, dude. Game battles. Bring back game battles, man. That was <laughs> that was a that was a timeline. Anyway. Yeah. So Grayson's gonna be going on with the Rob, and then we have Yellow Rello with uh, the uh, Yoshi. Um, it's probably just gonna go by just calling him Rello for the time being, but see how this one plays out, man. Uh, it's gonna be a pretty hard zoning game for the uh, for the beginning. I mean, obviously Yoshi is probably a little better off of. Uh, you know, a little better off of going in there and, uh, and and making things happen. But at the same time, you know, you don't want to just be the Yoshi jumping in and then getting blasted by a bunch of lasers and, and tops and stuff. So, yeah, I saw a little. I like this right here where he's like trying to flank between the uh, the top and the Rob coming in with the pressure and getting Yoshi right in the middle. All right, man. Here we go. Oh, Yoshi out here trying to find himself a neutral layer. Not going to find it just yet, but finds the, uh, finds the forward air. But a lot of forward air is coming actually from uh, from this Rob, man. Look, look, I like right. Yoshi getting the, the luck of the armor up tilt into up air. Not going to be enough. No, almost. Not quite enough, yeah. Yeah, Yoshi has has a little bit of weight on him. Never got to watch out for that. I am painfully aware of that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even say a little bit. I feel like Yoshi is more so like... Like, it is deceptively heavy because, you know, yeah, I mean, Yoshi's probably going to be heavy if you think about it can canonically, but sometimes Yoshi be living stuff I just don't ever think he would live, and I'd be like, all right, you got it, bro. <laughs> I think it's more that about that unique shield. Yeah, yeah, the... Well, you, can't, you can't shield poke. The unshield pokeable. Oh, my. Oh, wow. God. Both of them picking an option, and that, that was like a big bet. If he had did that forward air just a little later, he probably would have got past the entire hitbox, got the spike. But that up air was actually a really good option as well, coming back over the ledge, just in case uh, Rello was trying to do something aggressive. Oh, I'm trying to replicate last stock oh. right now. Oh, yeah, had to, I, I think he used the jump there too, so he had to use that egg throw or, or an air dodge to get back to the ledge. Man, yeah, this is looking rough right now for uh, Rello. Has not been able to find that last hit. Oh, yep. Oh. So uh, that either, I think he was most likely going for the parry, uh, but he did it too early. But yeah, you do not want to let both sides of uh, uh, Yoshi's down B hit your shield because that is a very shield breaking uh, type move. Now, yeah, it's not as good as Bowser's, like, but it definitely has a, a quite a bit of strength. Uh, so if you end up holding shield for a little later after that, you end up getting it's just gone. Okay. Rello back on stage, then right back to the ledge. Uh, I realize how, how how good that is for ledge pressure at the, the top. Down smash, yes. yep. Uh. Alright. See this now. Rob commanding soon as we won the game with skin. Trying to keep Yoshi out. Wow. Nice okay. extension from the uh, projectile. Yeah, I really thought he was about to. That was actually a really good read, but luckily Yoshi had enough aerial drift to get away from that up smash. Back into this game, though, uh, Rello's trying to get. I mean, he's got some decent damage on the second stock. Just has to fight. Oh, wow. Great egg. Oh, that was almost. Oh, now we're back in the match again. Yeah, back to the match, uh, or back in the match. We got 94% onto this Yoshi again. Kind of a heavy character, so has to take uh, maybe about another 30% before he's really in, like, uh, really in danger of losing the stock. Like that. Something you got to mix it up. I mean, they can go for the up smash, but uh, usually at those lower percentage. You know, you're, you're, you're thinking about the uh, up tilt, up air. So, you know, later on, like, I think now he's going to have to, like, look out for the up smash or he might not want to stay in the ground too much longer if he ends up getting grabbed again. But we'll see. Let's see if he, if he even gets grabbed. Yeah, we'll see. Grab himself. Okay. Yoshi finding the uh, down throw up air. 
Grayson finding himself a snap. Oh! Definitely thought that was just uh, going to be an up. Oh my god, the wow. air dodge is getting through everything. Yeah, getting really clutch right now. He's avoiding this. Cross up. Relatively good job bringing this back, actually, right now. Yeah, I mean, like, this is this is very doable. I think he hit the ground there, so. Let's get back to stage. Oh, the air dodge, and I think oh. that actually might be game. Yep, the Tombstone Pile Driver. You are gone. So, uh, he could have done down throw up smash two, but, like, the Tombstone Pile Driver right, uh, right above the platform, or right under the platform, was definitely guaranteed to hit the platform. You're gone. There was a point uh, late in that third stock where the Yoshi uh, grabbed the. Is it called the top? It's called the top. What, what do you call it? The, the, uh, the gyro. The we gy call it top gyro. Too, gyro. We can no. call it everything around here. We call it Beyblade. Well, gyro, whenever I play, top. <laughs> when I play my friends, Rob, I just call it the. I call it the dreidel because that's why I just want to make fun of him for it. I hate it so much. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the gyro. You opted to like throw it out. Do you find it's a? Uh, that's like a, a pretty good option to go for. Like just get rid of it. I don't even want to deal with it. Just like. Ugh. Um, you want to like the thing is you want to keep it. Like on, them. like you want to keep it away from Rob, but also uh, on stage or available so that Rob can't use it again. So a lot of times, like in, in longer matchups, you'll see people just pick the top up and like throw it straight up, and then that's like I don't know, that's like five six seconds of the top still being in the game, so Rob can't use it, but in but not available to Rob uh, because yeah, the top actually ends up being a, a huge part of his offense and defense. Uh, Oh, a lot, you know what I mean? Like, oh, I'm trying to come back to stage, I'm throwing the top. Oh, you're running straight at me, I'm throwing the top. I'm extending your top, top combo with the top. Like, there's all kind of stuff that it does. So you, you definitely want to try to take it out of the equation as quick as possible, or as much as possible. Gotcha. So, so we got counter to Yoshi's, right? Yeah, this is counter pick to, to Yoshi's. So I mean, and then, uh, so just recap here. Yoshi's is a smaller, a lot smaller than Battlefield, right? Uh, I actually do not remember. I know that, like, the... Uh, if you're talking about like the stage lanes, I think it's pretty comparable. But uh, the thing that Yoshi has going for it, Yoshi's has going for it, uh, it that Battlefield doesn't is the slants. Sometimes that messes up certain platforms. Uh, uh, things, you're right. So. Yeah, the slants and the walls that you can wall jump off of. Yeah, yeah. Bad, Although that that really doesn't apply too much to Yoshi. Yoshi doesn't have a wall jump. Yeah, they'll say, well, you, you, neither of these characters have a wall jump. So it yeah, so much. I'm not really sure. I guess the one thing that this would stop, I don't know if um, if Rob's uh, like. Up, up throw will hit the top platform or the platform if it's on the slam. Oh, that's a good point, actually. Yeah. So, like, that could be something. Or maybe he just really likes Yoshi that much that he's just like, you know what? I'm going to play on the Yoshi stage I'll tell you, I'll well. tell you what, though. Throwing projectiles from the slam definitely gives you uh, a better advantage. Yeah, that low, it's that low uh, it's that low angle. Hit lower. Oh, Ooh. hey, speaking of low, yeah, he dipped him super low right there. Nice board air for the spike. Might also help with Yoshi's egg bouncing uh, as well. So, you know, with the, with the platform being a little lower, or with, with the side being a little lower, it seems like uh, it, it, it kind of like allows the egg to bounce a little easier, or at least to, to guarantee the bounce. Wait, wait, his jump is gone. Yeah, the, because of the top. Wow. Yeah, so the, the gyro popped him out off the stage. Yeah, that was that was wild. I mean, I, I feel like that wasn't playing by Grayson, but now that he looks so big brain, like. Yeah, we'll take those. I was like, I got him we'll GG's right there, like. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yep. Almost enough to go ahead and take that stock, but even on that top platform. Wait a minute, is he out of a jump? I think he's saying. Oh, no, he's got yeah, it. Okay, yeah. wait. He, oh, he touched the ground. He touched the ground. Nice. Man, grab right here, and just wow. does not. He does not mash out in time. But like, you know what? I feel you because like sometimes like you're mashing and you're like using the triggers and stuff, so you end up buffering uh, an air dodge. So he's probably trying to like do like a very subtle mash. Yeah. And yeah, he just subtle mash a little too subtle. So. Okay. I, def I definitely feel that against like cables and stuff like that. Yeah. I just want to like. I can throw him like buff or hell or whatever. Hey, back here is gonna find his mark. Well, he is keeping the pressure all the way up on this robot right now. Nice a little up tilt string. Hey, mix. 
Oh, yeah, watch yourself. Now. Like you saw how much shield damage that did. That was a, wow. a nice conversion. Okay, four there for the uh, spike, for the bounce, and two the up air for the finish. All right, Rella so, bringing that one back. That was crazy, too, because I, I feel like you know, it was the first stage of Battlefield. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, so, like, you know, he kept the triplat. But, like, I don't know, maybe it was just the, just the scenery that really, like, <laughs> powered yeah, that, him up. The like, happy music and all that. Yeah, I'm wondering where you will get counter to now, actually. I think, like, what... Maybe FD because you have you have you have to now respect the lasers mm -hmm. coming from uh, Rob probably. Man, maybe. Uh, I can't imagine it'll go somewhere too too big. All right, man. So Three, two, this is a. Uh, into Ooh, game three. I, I called it. Okay, so the reason why I like him going to Talon City is because, like, the Rob can, like, angle his uh, lasers, right? Uh huh. So if there's too much platform camping, you know, I'm just going to call out with some, with some uh, angled lasers. And, but also, you know, sometimes the platforms leave, too, so it ends up becoming an FD uh, situation, which, by the way, I love this song. Uh, it's probably, like, my favorite song now of the uh, of the Animal Crossing songs, mostly because I've heard KK Rider and all that stuff too much. <laughs> but, yeah, this is a, this too is much a, of a good thing. Huh? Happy home designers that it's nice. Anyway. All right, man. So, like, you, you actually just saw Yoshi power through that down air, which could have been a big issue for him if he did not great air dodge back to the ledge. Okay. Trying to get the chase down. Actually, not, again, this song is a banger, actually. Yeah, this, I mean, dude, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's just, it's clean, man. It's, oh, I thought she was going to be off the top. Yeah, been in the reticle for a minute there now. Yeah, I'll smash it out of shield, man. You know, if you got a good one, definitely use it. Now I'm actually kind of interested how this Yoshi's going to get the stock off. I don't think he's got him direct. Uh, well, maybe he's got him directly into the up smash percentage now. But yeah, I was like, that first up smash that he threw, I don't think that was going to be up yet. Oh, top okay. thrown up. Grabs it again. Coverage from the top, too, so. And that was a, a pretty decent Yoshi bomb, uh, Yoshi bomb here from Yellowrello. Grab that up. Hold on. I was trying to get that uh, follow up right there, but it's a little bit out of range. Mm. Ooh, swift spot dodge to get out of that. Uh, Ooh, this game is not going well for Yellow, uh, for Rello at all. Grayson still on his first stock. Rello now on his last. Finds the F smash on the roll. But is it too little, too late? I guess we're going to find out for the rest of this game. He's got to play this one pretty close to the chest. As, uh, as I said, he's down to his last stock. This could be a little rough for him going up against Rob, who now has the lead and is allowed to run away from you. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh! Wait, wait. Ah, another, yeah, another that, jump taken. Is, is that another gyro that popped him off? He ate his jump so. and he fell? Yeah, I think so. So, uh, yeah. He, I mean, he hit the tech right there, but I guess he thought he had his jump and realized a little too late that he did not. So, uh, Grayson, I mean, really, that counter.